Hi guys, it's Dee and um, welcome to Sweet Treats by Dee. I know this is supposed to be a baking channel, but I am just not... Um, I'm still learning with how to take videos and do baking tutorials. I want to have it perfect, so that's why I just keep on vlogging on this channel. But hopefully you guys are enjoying what I have put in here. We went to Philippines and we had a short vacation. We usually stay there for a month. But this time, because my work won't let me go for a month or more than three weeks, we went there for 16 days. And during that 16 days, I was able to find some good stuff. And I went shopping Philippines. When you go shopping in Philippines, it's really cheap. So the first one is this cupcake holder. I bought it from We Went to the Pitan. And apparently that's another place where you can find good stuff. It's classic. I mean, I've been looking for something like this and for bakers like me, we always want to have something cute for our dessert tables. It's got six cupcake holders and it actually goes around, it moves. So I got it for 400 pesos. Yeah, 400 pesos in the Bitan, which is about 10 bucks. No, $15 Canadian. I got this really, really fluffy blanket, fleece blanket from Divisoria. It's a king size um, blanket. If Okay, if you're not familiar with Divisoria, it's a market where you can actually bargain. <laughs> so she was offering me, I think, 600 for this, and I told her final offer would be for 400 so which is another... So $15 Canadian again, and I am happy with this. It's really cute. It's got like cupcakes all over it. And then one of the things that I found too, you know Filipinos, we like karaoke. So this is a new thing that just came out, I guess. Well, it's new for us. Um, it's a Bluetooth karaoke microphone. Let me show you guys how it works. So it's Bluetooth and you just turn it on and you hear that sound you connect it to your bluetooth on your phone and you can do video key or karaoke um let me just oh it's connected now so it's got a volume for mic for the music and there's an echo there's the bass and anyways that's how it looks like and you just sing this one is versace on the floor by bruno mars And then I went to the same store when we went to Shangri-La and I found this Mia Care Spot Care Patch for Day. So there's three six patches on pack and I believe I bought this for about 240 pesos which is about $5 Canadian. This one says Paris. So it's sealed. So it looks like this and this is the, um, the lid. And it's so cute. I had to buy it. I just had to buy it. Sorry if I feel so self-conscious right now. I've never done a video like this. So this is the facial wash that I have been looking for. 
I went to Face Shop in Philippines and I found this. How the heck am I gonna find it again here if I need one? So I bought two, two tubes just in case. And this is usually good for the one that I've had. I used it for about six months. This is Everbelina, I believe, from Watson's. And it's matte color. So this is the color of the lipstick and when you swatch it, I haven't tried this but that's the color. So I'm happy with the color. I think I, I should I should use this tonight and just change this. Hmm. I bought some baking stuff from Landmark. I was able to find some pretty neat stuff there. But first one that I want to show you is this ultimate measuring set. So there's 19 piece set here. We bought this progressive ultimate measuring set. It's got 19 piece set, 10 cups and nine spoons. And you know, when you're a baker, you're always looking for measurements and how, like for measuring cups, like let's just say for one eighth cup or 30 millimeters. So this one's got everything. The first item is a tulip fondant cutter. So I'm just always looking for something neat. Um, this is a plunger that I bought and it can make tulips. So it's got a price here, a price tag of $99.75, which is about $4 Canadian. And then it's got this spatula for the buttercream. And this is just to design my buttercream or cake if I want. And then same thing here, and this is another scraper and spatula from Landmark, and it's $89.75 pesos, which is about $4 Canadian. Cutter, butterfly cutters, and this was for $59.75, which is about $3. And then this one is a set of three cake stencils. So it's got happy birthday, love, and just a bunch of flowers. So. This is what it looks like, and I got this for 129.75, 129 pesos and 75 cents, which is about um, five, six dollars Canadian. So I don't know what the heck happened. It just stopped recording for some reason, and I'm, I'm like going through all my stuff here, and it's not even recording. So I bought this butterfly plunger, fondant plunger, for 59.75, which is about. Two dollars and fifty cents, I believe, Canadian. And then I bought two fondant lifters, and with me, I just recently learned how to do buttercream flowers or buttercream roses. And every time I try to put it on the cake and lift it from the parchment paper, I keep dropping it. So I think this would help me. And then I bought two silicone um, molds for fondants and gum cakes. So this one is for baptism. It's got a heart, it's got a pin, it's got a bottle, it's got a star, it's got a cross, it's got, what is that thing? Oh, it's got a horsey and a baby carriage. Oh, this one was for 119 and 75 pesos. And this one is just a butterfly fondant plunger, or no, not plunger, it's a fondant <laughs> silicone mold and I got it for $99.75. And the last item that I have is an icing bag. It's a 35.6 centimeters icing bag. So I bought four of them, it's for $89.75. So usually what I use for my icing bags is I go to Daiso and I buy their plastic icing bags and I think there's a small one for with I think 16 pieces for two dollars and that's what I use but this one is always good to have something reusable and this is what it looks like it's actually a pretty big one too so anyway, that's it for my haul and um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, like I said, this is my first time making a haul video and I enjoyed showing and sharing what I bought from Philippines. So if you like this video, comment down below or give it a thumbs up. 
like my video or share it or whatever you want to do. But yeah, thanks for watching. See you again next time.